Where does the truth lie? Was an attempt made on Moses Wetangla's life? Or was he, as the police say, merely a victim of a billboard gone rogue? Senator Honorable Moses Wetangura of Bugoma County reported a shooting incident on his vehicle to Kiliman Police Station. The senator was being driven in the motor vehicle KBM 956M at Toyota Prado along Bagathe Road near City Mochari in company of his driver and a bodyguard. Officers immediately visited the scene of incident and investigation commenced. It's established that there was a piece of metal pipe hanging on the pole to one city mortuary with aluminum wire inside and another on the ground on the opposite pole. The observation indicates that the motor vehicle might have probably hit the piping of the banner. It was scratched by the wire connecting the lower part of the structure holding the banner. The dent on the top of the windscreen could have been caused by the impact on the edge of the metal pipe, which also has a dent. The huge bang was probably the result of collision with the burner structure. Forensic experts are currently carrying out investigations. We urge Honorable Wetangura, readers, and the public to remain calm as we await the forensic report to be added over and we shall update you. And so we decided to go to the scene of the incident and separate truth from fiction. These are the metal poles that held up the banner the police say attacked Watangla's vehicle on Thursday night. <laughs> And this is a car itself. Notice the scratches on its side. The dent on its roof. So, which is it? Billboard or a gun? For the Capital Weekend Report, I'm Olive Barrows. Yeah,